Welcome back to the four in the spirit of Italian Heritage Month. Bella Vita Fest this weekend in Little Italy. It's a celebration of Italian food, wine, art, and culture. It's going to be a lot of fun. It is the first ever celebration of its kind in Little Italy. It's the inaugural Bella Vita Fest. I'm joined by Kurt Brooker, who is uh, putting this all together. First off, uh, a novel idea. What's this all about? Well, we're super excited. We've been trying to pull this off for a couple years now. We used to run Festa, which had a lot of chalk art there. And that kind of that festival kind of went away. And then ever since then, everyone's been asking us, when's chalk coming back to Little Italy? So we've been working hard to bring it back. And now we're finally getting ready for this weekend. The chalk Art Festival, how many artists? And so it's going to be a closed off area and, and there are just going to be artists making these large murals on the ground all over the place. Yeah, absolutely. It's right down India Street, the main thoroughfare through Little Italy and the entrance is right underneath the Little Italy sign. We have 45 different chalk artists going down India Street on um, making these eight by eight huge squares. It's going to be incredible. You can actually see them start and then finish by the end of the weekend. And then after that, we power wash it all away and we start away. But, uh, you know, they're, they're just like you said, it's uh, uh, Italian music, Italian food. We have the amazing uh, chalk art. And then we also have a component to where uh, you can do wine tasting. And we have um, 22 different wineries imported from Italy from all 14 different regions. And you can uh, buy a ticket and taste uh, these amazing wines too from, um, from Italy. So where did you get the inspiration for this? Where does this even come from? Well, it all started from Festa, and then really we we really like we also do art walk events, and um, every every year that's one of our biggest questions: Where's the chalk? Where's the chalk? And we have to explain to everybody: Look, it's just not here. That's not this festival. But now we just decided we have to bring it back, and we're super excited. Saturday and Sunday all day, fifteen dollars are the tickets, fifty dollars for the wine, and kids are free, right? Kids under twelve. Kids under twelve are free. Uh, fifteen dollars just gets you in to really enjoy the festival, look at all the chalk art. And if you really do want to try some of this amazing wine, uh, it's just a little bit up from there uh, at $50, but you get to taste it all and really enjoy it. All right, looking forward to that. I'm, I'm going to go over to the food part right now. I'm really excited. Bernadette Tarantino with Tarantino Gourmet Sausages. Right, yes. And you are a 100% San Diego, like, homegrown business, right? Yes, we are. Actually, I was born in Little Italy also. That is fantastic. You've been doing this for 50 years. And so are you primarily a supplier for Italian restaurants and other restaurants in San Diego? Actually, we've turned into manufacturers. Okay. So we manufacture manufacturer at we it's at Costco where the um, sausage for Petco Park and Snapdragon and um, a lot of other markets around we do have still a few restaurants but we're mainly concentrating on our uh, manufacturing how cool is it uh, obviously that's an Italian last name well, you know we, we got that going for us here so as that how much fun is it to be represented and to be able to celebrate something like this in little Italy and show people off people who might not know about you guys right it's f so much fun I just love it would you like me to show you how I yeah, what, what okay. do you got here I'm gonna well, make her eat because I only have one microphone well, and I can't talk I and eat I wanted to show you how we um, assemble the sausage All right. so right here we put it on a bun and then we put the marinara oops a little oh, bit much sorry. on the top so it doesn't get too messy and then after that we put on the peppers and onions and then and will people be able to get this this weekend oh yeah we're gonna have it we're gonna have lots of it oh so gosh and, mild. and then we put some parmesan cheese on it and it's a feast and so are you going to be behind a booth or are you going to be out trying all the different wines? That's what I want to know. I'm probably going to be both places. <laughs> <You know? laughs> a little bit back and forth in different parts of the yeah. day. We'll know how many wine purveyors you've hit. Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Bernadette Tarantino. Get real red. <laughs> there you go. All of us. Thanks for that so much. And so we, we talked about the wine and food. We talked about the event. There's also so much art and we have a special treat for you on that. We're going to go inside with our Heather Myers is going to show you uh, something that's been being worked on all day. I understand understand and uh, it, it's gonna be quite a treat it is a sample an example of the kind of art you're going to see all over little Italy this coming weekend in addition to having fantastic wine and food Heather why don't you take it away Oh, okay, so Kaz just came on here with the camera and I want to show you this. We have artist Cecilia Lanau joining us. Cecilia, look what you created right here in our green room. One piece of chalk art. How, how do you do this? Like, where do you start? Uh, well, this one, um, they asked me to do the skyline because it's uh, for, the, for the channel. Yes. 
But when it's up to me and when I want to uh, create a piece of art, I usually look for personal inspiration, like with a piece behind well, me. Well, I'm saying that's just gorgeous, and that's all done with chalk. All chalk. <laughs> all done with chalk. That is absolutely incredible. So I want to show our viewers a little sort of video that we captured. You walked into our studios here before 8 o'clock this morning, and we said, okay, here's a blank slate get to work and what's step one when you're putting together a project like this so step one is taking uh, taking the original and then um scaling it so it'll fit the size of in this case this wall and this is our downtown san diego yeah this is our skyline. beautiful skyline how did you get into art so um it's something that i've always loved to do and I was fortunate enough to get my degree in art and I work as a professional artist. I also teach. Um, and chalk is just one medium that I work in and it just happens to be the most public because so many people will come to a street painting festival. And check it out. I mean, it's amazing. Yeah. So we only have about 30 more seconds here, but Cecilia has been working on this, friends all day long. I have not even <laughs> seen her take a lunch break so far, but she's letting me be a part of the big reveal. So you're grabbing the tape on one side. Yeah. I'll grab it on this side and we'll tear it off. Are you ready? Ready? Three, two, <laughs> Here we go. Oh, I don't want to mess it up. I'm going to be so careful as we come along here. and We're going to see what this looks like because I took the paint off the wall a little bit. Okay. And here she comes on. I'll grab you that, have that one. There we Go! Da da! Beautiful yep. once job. The once the tape is off, the work is finished. The work is done. Well, thank you so much for coming in here and making our green room extra special. Can we find you this weekend down in Little Italy? Absolutely. Absolutely. Both Saturday and Sunday, I'll be painting a Madonna because it's iconic for uh, Italian art. And it's also Our Lady of the Rosary. 100th anniversary we'll that's the church that's in little italy that's the hub of the community and you're going to make it special with your chalk right there on the streets of little italy I want to share some information with our viewers if you would like to come down as carlo mentioned it's saturday and sunday all of the information is at bellavitafest.com